Today we are studying the Mesozoic Era. The Mesozoic Era was the era of dinosaurs. Other reptiles like crocodiles, tortoises, snakes and lizards also came in this period. Birds, mammals and the first flowering plants also appeared. Era ended with the disappearance of many life forms. Now, the life forms we are talking about are the dinosaurs or the snakes, the crocodiles of the time, because the snakes were humongous. The Titanoboa, you can take for example, or the crocodiles, which was known as the Sarcosuchus or Lycosuchus, which were very large crocodiles. Now, the Mesozoic era consisted of three periods, first being the Triassic period, second being the Jurassic period, and the last being the Cretaceous period in which the mass extinction happened. Now the Triassic period, Earth basically looked like this. And the Triassic period was the first period of Mesozoic era when the dinosaurs came back. Now in this era, Earth was joined into Earth was joined into two continents known as Gondwana and Laurasia or Eurasia and was starting to break and become like the modern land the modern day continents. The Jurassic period was the second period in the most famous of the all three periods. The Jurassic period is the second period of the Mesozoic era in which many new dinosaurs came like Brachiosaurus, Stegosaurus and many more. Now you see in the previous one it wasn't much breaked up like before. Now you can see that this is more broke up and later on it is going to become like our like the continents of the present time. Now comes the Cretaceous period in which Earth was now more broken as you can see this is Africa, this is South America, this is going to be Antarctica and many these were basically broken up into the continents but were in the, in the places or there are in the present. This is the last period of the Mesozoic era in which many species of dinosaurs came, but the period ended with mass extinction of dinosaurs. Now you know the asteroid that hit the, the dinosaurs came in this period and hit the earth. Now you can see that it was like this. Then it became like this, and then it became like this. Now, we all know about the mass extinction was created by an asteroid. Now, coming up, I'm going to teach about the Chicxulub asteroid. The Chicxulub asteroid was the asteroid which killed the dancers. The impact that it did and killed the dinosaurs, and the asteroid wiped out dinosaurs from earth but not the size of it it's because the angle it hit on now the earth was hit on exact 90 degree angle with chick slub asteroid creating so much force that it led to mass extinction of the dinosaurs now just think about it if the if that asteroid would have deviated from its place, it would have killed, it would not have killed the dinosaurs and maybe humans wouldn't be alive. Now the Chicxulub asteroid was so strong that it was, it had so much force that the Chicxulub asteroid impact distance diameter was 10 kilometers or 6.2 miles the diameter of 
the diameter of the Chicxulub asteroid was 150 km or 93.2 miles. The angle was 90 degrees, which is the main thing because of which the dinosaurs were wiped off Earth. That's it for this video and in the next video we are going to talk about Cenozoic era and after that a timeline would be completed and I would then go to the dinosaur form, the types of dinosaurs and the previous life forms. Thank you for watching. L please like, share and subscribe.